Okay, you want to release the scenario? Okay, here we go. Okay, hi, good day. I'm Mike Young. Um, I'm ex Royal Air Force uh, Harrier pilot uh, from the UK. Now, uh, group leader of the test pilots uh, the CAE in Montreal, in charge of all the, uh, the military evaluation and testing of the simulators. Here I'm sitting in a, a demonstrator version of the Air Mackey 346, uh, lead in fighter a trainer. Uh, we're under contract to build uh, some simulators for the Italian Air Force with through Air Mackey. And here we have flying over the island of Guam, a rich database, uh, 3D population. Ahead of me there is a, another Air Mackey 346, which I'm uh, sort of following him as he flies around. He's going to be turning around in a minute and doing an approach back at uh, the main base at Guam. So I'm flying freely, uh, not constrained by what he's doing. Uh, he's on a, a path that uh, I actually recorded back in Montreal. So as he turns, he's slowing down journey to do the approach back at the base. We're showing here at uh, INSEC uh, our latest medallion uh, visual system, IGs, our new uh, volumetric clouds which are very effective and they're moving with the wind and they have the shadows cast on the ground which uh, if you can see that they're, they're moving across the ground as well. Now coming into view is the uh, the airfield with all the approach lights. He's setting himself up for a low approach. Touch and go. And I'm going to try and close up to him. I guess. He'll put his gear down in a minute, <coughs> or in a few seconds, hopefully. All right, his gear's coming down now. He's going to go up and around and uh, we'll head off across the island at low level. In the cockpit here, we uh, we built this as a demonstrator with a, a linear Air Mackey. <coughs> this is a touch screen, just as a demonstration of what the, uh, the flight instruments and controls will do. It's all interactive, push button, or touch as I said, touch screen. The uh, the real simulator when we deliver it will have the real uh, or replicated instruments in here. So that as far as the student pilots concerned, it will be just like the real aircraft. There'll be a head-up display as per the aircraft. And this to the touch screen will be similar to what's going to be involved on the instructor station, which is uh, off board outside the simulator, along with a lot of other screens to help the instructor uh, run and uh, monitor and manage the mission.